A common mistake to try to wow the user. Better to focus on your central message. Users tend to read it differently online than they do in print. Um, the, the main reason is that people are really in a hurry uh, when they're online, and there are many other places that they can go to get their information and any other websites that they could be visiting. So, um, users, users tend to scan or scan the pages. Contact details, obviously every site, every site should provide easy to access, easy to understand, easy to follow contact details. Search, obviously there's two ways of doing this. On-site on search, which is kind of hard to do, therefore I'm falling out of fashion except for big companies. But obviously, search optimization for Google is becoming ever, ever bigger. Um, so, so we need to people based on our research, research to focus on, on the benefits, focus on the facts, and you're more, more likely, likely to get the, the reader's, reader's attention. And then this is more true, true on the web than, than it is in print. Pretty and artistic, or do you want it readable? Pretty is nice, but readable is most important, in my opinion. A designer who can accomplish both is a good designer. Whenever it's time to assess the usability of your project, you can use a checklist that you make yourself. To make a checklist, start with your favorite usability book. Here's About Face by Alan Cooper. Go through the table of contents and pick out the chapters that speak to you. Add them to your checklist. Then you can supplement your checklist with information from other sources, including online, and your own experience.